Okay, so I thought I'd just do a little vlog style video of like my convention prep. Um, just got accepted into NCM London Comic Con, so it's only the 23rd of February, but I'm starting out a bit early to <laughs> get everything ready. So I'm working on some Voltron stickers. Um, these are misprints because the colours have come out a little wonky. Um, I did do a test print but this is just a scrap piece of paper that I do like little testers on to see if the colours are right. I wasn't paying attention. I thought they were right but they're not. <laughs> so yeah, what's the point of doing test prints if I'm not going to pay attention? But anyway, I just need to redo the colours on these. Apart from these two, these are fine. These three need new colours. And then I'm going to cut them out. Well, print them out and then cut them out. Okay, so just done a little test print and the colours are much better. Show you this one. Yeah, they're not as yellow. <laughs> so yeah. Test prints are always a good idea. Yeah, this is just a, a scrap piece of printer paper, so the quality is not brilliant, but it's just to test out the colours to see if they're right this time. <laughs> but yeah. Now to arrange them on this piece this sheet on here and just print them off. Don't stand on the stickers! God's sake, man. He still stood on the stickers. Oh, hello, 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 hello. Hey. <laughs> oh, really? Oh, really? Oh, really? Hello. Excuse me. Excuse me. Hey. <laughs> Sasha, you can't sit there. I'm waking. <laughs> Goodbye. Okay, so here are the final stickers. Um, I'm really happy with them. They took like a day longer than I thought they were going to just because I messed up on the colours, but yeah. Not bad. I like them. Yeah, Voltron is a new obsession. <laughs> okay, I just laid out all my stickers just so that I know which ones I have now. And I don't know what it is but I love seeing them all laid out. <laughs> um, I keep them in like those money bags that you get from the bank when you get change, just so they're all separate and it's easy. <laughs> but yeah, I love lining them up. These ones have all just been listed on Etsy, so they're all ready to go. I don't have as many of each of them as I'd want for putting them up straight away, but eh. <laughs> That's all I had. That's all the paper I had. <laughs> so yeah. This one is entirely self-indulgent. Yeah. Hardly anybody's ever bought one, but I have to have something Stargate related. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Fun with the compress. Okay, so I just had to buy a new laptop charger for my laptop. 
for this one. Yeah, hopefully this one should be here um, sometime soon, like next week or so. I'm hoping the current one kind of lasts as long as possible. <laughs> But yeah, can't afford a new laptop, so let's just get a new charger. This is why I have to buy a new one. It's so close to breaking. It's kind of scary. I also found this at Asda for £7, and I actually stopped dead when I saw it. I was like, oh, I didn't watch it in the pictures. So, £7, not bad. And it comes with... Um, Pokemon the first movie as well which I already have on DVD but yeah now I have this okay so at the minute I'm just gonna be working on some little mini like framed originals I have these there's 10 of these little photo frames that came in a packet and they just look like this um, I'm just gonna do some little mini originals put them in there and then take them to the next con there's, I had a few before this is the only one I've got left um, they kind of look like that, just look like that, stuck on the back. Um, but yeah, I really like them. I like them for doing like little pieces of fan art that I don't want to make like a big, massive print for that I just want to do like a one-off for. So that's what I'm going to be doing. This one is going to be, I think, Princess Mononoke. That's what I'm looking at. Um, this one, I'm going to do a Princess Mononoke. Um, there's ten of them, so I want to do a mix of one-off fan arts and some originals, so we'll see how far I get today. Okay, so this is the sketch so far. Um, I've erased the lines a bit just so that it's not as noticeable underneath the markers. So I'm going to use my pro markers for this. And then I'll go over the lines when I'm done. I find that I really like doing the line art last. Um, I don't know, I think it just looks a little bit nicer that way. Yeah. So here is the final piece. I'll just put a little business card in the back. And yeah. I'm super happy with how it turned out. I wasn't planning on doing these today. I just kind of felt like it. So yeah. I now have two. It's Sunday now and I just got an Etsy order so I'm just gonna pack it up and I'll so it's ready to send out tomorrow. Um Lady bought a bookmark and I'm just putting in um a blend print just as a little freebie so yeah okay so here's a final little mini original it's Shami from Blue Exorcist I love that show um, there she is with the other two 
I'm really liking how these are turning out. I like the challenge of like simplifying a design but still making it recognisable. So yeah, I really like doing these. I think my next job for today is to work more on this Hermione Granger piece. Uh, piece, piece. Um, it's been a couple of days since I've worked on it and I really want to get back into it. So yeah, I'm hoping to make this into a print. I'm really trying to do my best to do more detailed pieces, so yeah, I think this is a good start for detail. <laughs> okay, so I've made a bit more progress. I've gone over the sketch, then I scanned it in and printed it out on A4 piece paper just so it's bigger, and then I've just traced it onto the watercolour paper. So, not watercolour paper, this paper this one mixed media paper so yeah and then I changed bits again so I've like redone her hair a bit added the bookcase to the back well finished off the bookcase and but yeah that's where I'm at um, I think it's ready to be painted I think so I'll probably do that tomorrow yeah I'm happy with it so far Okay, today's Monday, and I don't know if you can see that, but it's snowing and sunshine at the same time. I just finished this one. Um, I just had the urge to draw big bushy hair. <laughs> well, I need some practice because I've got to do my Hermione piece in a bit. But, yeah, this was the first one that I did, and it just went so wrong. <laughs> so smudgy. Yeah did it again and I'm much happier with it. Um got a pile of pro markers. <laughs> I think before I do anything else I need another cup of tea. Oh it's so cute. I did not realise that cat was there. <laughs> oh crap, it's easy. Oh, that's not my cat by the way. <laughs> So cute. My camera doesn't zoom very well, so apologies for the bad quality. <laughs> Just got to do a bit of minor surgery on this fridge magnet. Its legs fell off. <laughs> Just clip back on with this. I think it should be fine. Just gotta let it dry. <laughs> it is cool. So today is Tuesday and I'm just going through all of my prints and seeing what I've got, what I wanna make more of and like if I've got enough of like merch, like badges and bookmarks and things. I'm just going through seeing what I wanna keep and any designs that I don't wanna do anymore. Um, for example, this one in the corner, I don't want to do any more prints, so that's the last print, but she's got a badge, and it does a lot better as a badge, sells a lot better as a badge than it does as a print, so I'll keep badge, but once the print's gone, I'm not doing any more prints. And this one, A4 is staying, A5 is staying, and badges are fine. This one, I need to get rid of the 6x4 prints and do A5 prints. A4 is fine, the badges are fine, I think. Yeah, I don't need to do any more badges. This one need more A4s, more A5s, and badges are fine. On this one, I need to get A5s, not 6x4s. Same with this one, same with this one, as well as I need to do more badges. This one, and more stickers. These two, I need to do more stickers and badges, and then do the Five by seven prints instead of the six by fours. Uh, same for this one, except I don't need any more badges. This is a, the last Halloween print, so it's the last one of that one. So once that's gone, that'll be gone. And this one is the same. I just need to change the six by four prints to five by seven prints. 
and this one's fine but again the little prints this one I need to do a four prints of and these three as well as this one they I did them slightly too big so but they're, they're still fine they're just the wrong size so I'll still sell them but I'll sell them at the price of the size that I should be so these are a5 size this is 5 by 7 I want 5 by 7 size <laughs> So once these, there's only two of each of these, so that's fine. Uh, but I'll be selling them at the same price as these because they were supposed to be that size. Um, I think I'm going to make a badge out of this one. That's fine. That's fine. I just need more stickers. This is fine. I just need to do the different print size. This I'm not going to do as a print anymore, but I'm going to keep the badge same as this one. And then that different size that one I don't want to do anymore and that I think I'm changing the size and keeping the badge and for this print um, I need a4 size and 5 by 7 size it gets very complicated with all the different sizes <laughs> um, don't need to do any more badges and I don't need to do any more bookmarks so they're fine um, but I put that there to remind me to write it down that I do actually need prints of that because I don't have any left um, but other than that I think I've got it all written down of everything that I need to do so yeah <laughs> um, I've got plenty of time I've got two two new prints oh and there's another there's another print that goes along with that another fairy one that I need to do 5x7 size. Then I've got my new evolutions print and my Hermione Granger print when I actually get round to finishing it. <laughs> well, yeah. And I've also been going through my badges and just making sure that I've got enough of each of them. I've made notes of all the ones that yeah, like I said, I've made notes of everything that I want to do, and now I just have to do it. <laughs> yeah. I'm sat weirdly on my chair, by the way. But yeah. I always forget, like, how many designs and prints I actually have until I lay them all out. I don't know. It's nice seeing them all out. update on the fridge magnet, the frog fridge magnet, and I think it's fine. Yeah. Time to go back on the fridge. Tuesday is also my editing day, so I am editing this week's art video. Uh, it's nearly done, so it didn't take that long. And it should, and it will, will be up tomorrow. So yeah. <laughs>started work on the Hermione piece this is where I'm at and just putting down like light washes of where I want particular colors and just starting to work along the wall uh, this is my filming setup by the way <laughs> I have an old phone um, one of the metal wire things I use at, dis at conventions a display stand that was like had these on them and some books <laughs> And my light. <laughs> this is for when I want to film like bigger pieces. If it's just a little piece, I have um, just a little tripod that I put the my phone on. So yeah, that's that. Okay, so it's Wednesday, and my new adapter charger thingy arrived in the post. I thought it was only going to get here on Friday, so this is nice. Yeah, I'm actually really terrified of trying it with my laptop. <laughs> I don't know what it is, I think, I don't know, it'll be fine, it's the right model and everything, I know I've got the right one, it's just, I'm terrified, <laughs> I've never had to buy a new adapter for my laptop, for any laptop I've ever had before, so, <laughs> well it's plugged in and it didn't explode, so, yeah, the light's green, so let's try and turn it on. Well, making a bit of progress. Um, 
think I'm on about my sixth episode of Atlantis. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm getting there slowly. Getting there slowly. I'm trying to make myself take more time on this because I tend to just like finish an entire piece in a day. And I don't know. I just want to see what I can do if I spend more time on it. I'm liking how it is at the minute. I'm still. I think I've still got quite a way to go, but I really want to add something here because when I planned it out, like it stopped here. <laughs> but. Yeah, somehow I've managed to gain space. Don't ask, I don't know how it happened. <laughs> it's usually the opposite. Yeah, I want to try and add something here. So, I don't know yet. Yeah, it's coming along nicely. I do a lot of layers in my watercolours, so it doesn't look finished until it's actually finished. <laughs> so yeah, I think I'm going to work a bit more on her face because it's been kind of neglected. <laughs> only had like two layers on it and everything else is on it's like 20th so yeah hey everybody it is now Thursday and I'm just packaging up another Etsy order I uh, just thought I'd show how I package up um, badges when somebody orders more than one I just put them on a little piece of um, I think it's called funky foam but it just kind of stops them from like rattling about and scratching everything so yeah I like it. She bought these two badges, which I think are two of my favourites, <laughs> and this bookmark, and can't get all of it. This bookmark, and I'm also going to pop in um, a Beth print. This is a little freebie. So, yeah. Okay, the last thing on my to-do list for today is um, to print off some 5x7 prints. Um, I have a, a little crafter on Sunday, so I just wanted to print off some of the 5x7s that I don't have any of. So yeah, here's the picture of blue. This is the one that I didn't have any of. So, do that. I'm having a bit of trouble with printing off some more of these because <laughs> I've tried three times now and it's the only one that keeps um, printing with lines across. So I've tried it three tries, uh, three times and I might just have to stick with just having one. <laughs> but it doesn't do it with any other print, like none of them have done it apart from this one and it's super annoying. But, yeah, I've tried everything that's usually worked in the past, but, ugh, <laughs> this is the downfalls of doing your own prints, is if you don't know what's wrong, you just don't know what's wrong. <laughs> but, luckily these are all fine. So yeah, I think that's where I'm going to end this vlog. I'm going to edit it tomorrow and upload it tomorrow, which will be Friday the... 2nd of March so yeah so the prints are all done they're all cut and the corners are rounded they're all on backing card and they've got like little business cards in the back so we have two of grace two of spaced out uh, three of ruby two of blue and two of Galaxy Girl. Yep, two. So, yeah. Okay, like I said, I'm going to edit and upload this tomorrow for Friday, on Friday. And hopefully, I can make these a, like a weekly thing because it's been nice, like filming bits and pieces of my day throughout the week. And it's kind of forced me to be more productive. <laughs> so, yeah, let's. Hopefully this will become a regular, the re the regular weekly vlog. Wow, that was hard to say. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.